Yes, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, <laughs> today's video, we gonna do something a little crazy. Okay. Well, actually, it's really not. Well, it's not crazy. I feel like. Okay, let me put this chapstick on. I feel like there's always some type of curling tool that's coming out weekly at this point, and I'm so disappointed in myself. I am because when I saw these on Amazon, I was like, bet I'm gonna be the first YouTuber to come out with them joints. I ordered it from right after I did my straw set, and then when it came in the mail, I was like, dang, this looks literally just like. Fast forward to like a month later, I see Khadijah Nicole. I've been following her since before I even had a YouTube channel. Anyway, she did it on her channel maybe a few days ago, and I was like, "Oh, so this is what we this is what we doing? So this is what we doing? <laughs> all right, I see what you did there. She beat me to it. After I saw what hers looked like, I was like, "All right, fine, dang, I'm gonna do it then." So Khadijah, shout out to you. You encouraged me to finally take these out of the package and do it myself now she said she got hers from wish i got mine from amazon but i think amazon got theirs from wish because the writing is in chinese on these things so whatever that ain't no problem i'm just going to do this hairstyle on this hair so i may have underestimated how much i might need to actually probably rinse out my hair but the reason why i don't want to wash my hair is because i'm i'm lazy i don't want to now this edge control got a little crusty up here we're just gonna all right all right brand new like it never happened okay so what i am gonna do though for this style i want to do it on like semi stretched hair so i'm gonna spritz my hair with water and then use like medium heat to blow out my hair just a little bit all right so you know this is not an official blowout and i don't know if this was actually the best idea but we already started so we gonna go with it so with this hairstyle i'm gonna just run through this part real quick because this is not part of the tutorial but i am gonna do a little braided hairstyle in the front on the top because i'm like yo I cut my hair let's do some fun stuff with it instead of just a side part or a middle part like let's have some fun I'm gonna do something with the top of my hair okay you guys so I decided to be basic and just do the little rubber band things so basically all I'm doing put my hair down the middle right here I got a, I got a little bit of flakes but we gonna <laughs> we're not gonna talk about it and then try to get it even up with this side here Alright, real quick, I just want to show you guys, I'm taking a piece from this side section over here and bringing it all the way over to this side section over here. This is how I envision my hairstyle to look with just like a whole bunch of cute curls. So let me show you the product tools, the product tools, the tools, the curling tools that we're going to be using today. So, so it looks like this. Can we, can we get a focus? All right, so it looks like this. There's a hook at the top to hook your hair in and then it's just kind of like spirally all the way down. It also comes with like this little thing that you're supposed to attach on the bottom of your hair like this and then you like clip it to the bottom to make sure your ends stay. I'm gonna first do a few off camera to make sure I have the mojo of how to do it so there's not a whole bunch of fluttering around. So I'm gonna do a few off camera and then I will be right back. Y'all I just wanna say that these little hair tool things 10 out of 10, do not recommend these. This is my biggest regret. I hate these. I hate these. I hate these. I, I hate these. I got about nine in my hair right now. It's been a little bit of a struggle to get these in. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just, I'm struggling. I started all of them off with a twist and then ended up off with a little spiral because I feel like doing my whole head with the whole um, thing or whatever is gonna just make my hair way too Shirley Temple, way too like corkscrewed too tight and I don't want that. Really they could have came up with a better idea for the ends on how to apply these to the ends because it's a little tricky. I'm not really enjoying this very much. I'm not. Using one pump of my Texture ID styling mousse foam thing and like I said I started off with a twist. So they have a little hook on there. Hook it on to my hair like so. And then like let my hair follow into the little dips and dives of the tool. Towards the end of my hair, I'm just gonna add a little bit more 
mousse to the end. There we have it. Looks all fun and dandy, right? <laughs> No. So you're supposed to put it on with this or like secure it with this little thing here. Getting it on, first of all, it's it's a hassle in itself. I would just leave them alone, but I know that the foam is not strong enough to just hold my hair like that. So you kind of just pop it on. It looks like it just pops on, but and watch it pop on for this video. Of course, I knew it would work. But let me tell you, the first 10 times it wasn't working, but whatever. And then you just secure it like that. Let me tell y'all something. When this camera was not on, I was struggling a lot. But all of a sudden, the camera's on, everything wanna work. That's how it always go. So that is just all I've really been doing. So I'm just spraying it a little bit. I know I blow dried my hair, so it's kinda like, well, why are you making it wet again? I just feel like my hair just feels really dry. And since I have to brush out the old curls from my wash and go, I don't wanna brush it out on extremely dry hair. So, like I said, I'm going to twist the top right here. Again with the hook. I'm going to hook it onto my hair. And then... Low-key messed up on this one, but I'm not going to start over because I'm over it. But y'all get the picture. Take our little purple thing and snap it on. me like three hours I don't know why it took me so long but um here we are here we are here we are so I'm going to go ahead and sit under a dryer I use a whole pack of one and then like three out of the next pack and that's with putting this up so if you're gonna do your whole head I would suggest you getting two packs let me just turn around so you guys can see my whole head Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and sit underneath the dryer for like an hour because I need my hair to be done tonight. That's kind of why I wanted to start off on dry hair because I wasn't sleeping in this overnight. Hopefully it dries, y'all send up a quick prayer for me and then I will be right back. Alright, hey you guys, so I'm back. I only sat under the dryer for like an hour and 15 minutes. I mean, it feel alright. Feels dry to me. But like I said, that's why I wanted to start it off on blow dried hair. That it wouldn't take as long because I knew that I had somewhere to be tonight. Couldn't sleep in it overnight. Anyway, so we just gonna get this show on the road. Let's just start from the back and take one out back here and see what we are working with. So we got these stupid purple things. I'm gonna unhook it from up here. Oh, and then just unravel. Oh, cute! That's so cute. Huh, okay, let's get it then. So, give you guys a nice little close up. Both sides. So now I'm gonna do my edges really quick so that my edges can set while I separate and fluff the curls that we have in our head. All right, y'all, so here are what the curls are looking like. I know you can't really tell the full thing because my headband is on and it's kind of messing up the experience, but I'm gonna just go ahead and stretch them just a little bit and then I will take my headband off and then we can see.
Let me fluff it out a little bit. This kind of cute. I actually kind of like this. And now I wish that I actually would have done my whole head and not done this weird thing that I did in the front because I'm not really feeling the weird thing in the front here. But the rest is cute. I actually really like these curls a lot. Come on, y'all can't tell me it's not cute. I don't know what the back is looking like, but. Anyways, y'all, I'm really sorry if this was super rushed. I will leave the link in the description box where I got this on Amazon. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.